Bowen, this is Doctor Who season 9. This is episode 3 and this is part 4 of the Sea Devils. Let's go. A part of me really thinks that the Sea Devil's going to go through the minefield and it's going to not, not end in a, in a happy way, to be honest. God, I wonder if they're in like Margate or something. It looks freezing. There's only one thing for it. You have to go through the minefield. Oh, he's going to set them off. Oh shit, maybe you shouldn't have done that. I don't like that the bed died. That noise is horrible. The poor sod. That marine indicator boy still won't release, sir. All right, Summers. Radio Captain Hart, the moment you surface. Tell him we're immobilized on the seabed by some unknown force and intruders have broken through the hull. Aye, aye, sir. All right, number one. Hold it fire and we'll see if we are. Hey! Don't shoot them. That creature that you saw is one of a race of intelligent reptiles that has a deadly hatred of mankind. Now, somehow, they've established themselves in the sea. That horse is beautiful. Half dead, land space, dry aboard, sir. Believe a word of it. <laughs> well, I can assure you, we didn't walk ten miles across open countryside just to tell you. I wonder if that's a decent scotch. Coming out of the sea. But it's different this time. Everybody saw it, even Trenchard and the guards. And you it is what? Well, he's developed some way of communicating with them. Probably a ultra high frequency sonic beam. He's rather good. Come on. No, thank you. Sammy. Thank you, Doctor. You won't let me help you. All right then, Doctor. What do you want me to do? Well, the key to this whole situation is at the castle. Sir, oh. I think we've got something. <gasps> Yay! It um, still needs a few minor adjustments, that's all. Look, I've been giving some thought to all this. It's a bad idea. It's going to be an enormous job coping with these creatures. <laughs> Oh. That can't be great being in the water in those costumes. You need to sort yourself out. God? Yeah, God's dead. The master's just chilling, thinking. Plans come together. Oh, I don't want any of them to die. Did you get through to Captain Hart? It's probably Bovril. Well, they're definitely getting an echo and the object's what moving. Have they re-established contact? It's a message from one of the search vessels, sir. They are getting an echo. The submarine? Yes, it's moving ah. towards the port now. Uh... You know, as much as I like Joe as a character, 
I still sometimes yearn for Liz to be in these situations. I would have loved to have seen how she would have coped in these stories. I've got a mate Sorry, with us. God's sake. He's gone. This story's getting more kind of complex <laughs> the more parts we get through. Um, I'm still enjoying it though. It's been a really good story to watch so far. Um, I'm really interested to see how kind of the next episode unfolds, like where is the Doctor? Um, why are these um, sea devils taking the submarine to this certain location? Um, I'm assuming that's where all the other boats have gone. Is there going to be a place where there's just people everywhere that have, the sea devils have kind of taken? Um, I just don't know really, um, but I'll go watch the next one. Thank you.